Since they emerged from the 70s, Brainhammer has been rocking for 30 years. The only members of the band are Arthur McThunderbottom, vocals and guitar, and Steve Morocco, vocals and drums. This power duo has been touring the world. They have rocked the Budokan in Japan and have rolled the Coliseum in Rome. This band got started in the summer of 65. Flower power was sweeping across the nation and it inspired two young men. You, you Arthur, start playing guitar. Ever since I was little, my father bought me this here acoustic. I've been playing ever since. Well, when did you, Steve Morocco, start playing drums? Well, I just wanted to play drums because I just wanted to make a lot of noise. How did you form this wonderful band we know as Brainhammer? Well, I met Steve here in high school. We had a friendship. But no, it was actually more of a brotherhood. Brotherhood of funk. We started this band for one reason. One reason only. Go ahead, tell them. For the ladies. After that, they pretty much wrote some songs, got a fan base, and they got into the recording studio. They released their first album, Fish Out of Water. I wrote a song. I really hope it could go on the new album. Maybe. My Ollie, I love you. We met in high school, doodly doo. Did you like it? What do you think? No, I hated it. What's the one rule? What's the one rule? We don't write songs about ladies. We don't? No. But she's my wife. Who cares? My beautiful wife, Molly. I love her so much. Well, we met in high school. Yes, high school sweethearts. I guess he liked me and he never said anything. So I made the first move. So we've been dating for a while. When we went to prom together, I knew she was the one. We got married in 79. Let's just say she's the light in my doom world. Oh, Arthur. I love you. This is where we eat our meals. This is where we entertain our guests. This is where me and my husband sleep at night. But during the day, it's the music factory. Here at Smithtown Studio, we have the latest technology in recording, and this, what does it look like? A steering wheel grip thing. You can hear everything you play perfectly and it doesn't come up like on your pickups of a guitar or microphones and the drums. Let's talk about the review. The review said we couldn't, why couldn't this band be out of our lives? It's a sad attempt to sum up the 60s generation. Well, I never heard of that one. That may be somehow, but somehow we got a fan base and it grew stronger. In the early 80s, you released Thunder Kiss Magic. The review read, it's a stupid assault like a creepy guy raping your ear. They can't print that! Brain Hammer has been touring for the past 10 years since they released their last album. Here's some footage from their show in Illinois, 1995. But recently there was a major accident. Steve spontaneously combusted. It's a sad day for everyone. Steve will greatly be missed. The things fans loved about him the most were his drum solos. This is the drum solo of life. The sad thing is that I promise never to play again. Today you leave me, but I'll see you again. It's time to say goodbye. You know I. So at last, the epic journey known as Brainhammer comes to an end.
Oh yeah, burn hammer. Yeah. Oh, wait, what burn hammer? What? Oh yeah. Those guys are pretty cool, man. They give me a free t-shirt. Like three of them. Kind of small though. Yeah, Arthur, man. Yeah. Pretty cool guy, man. Singer or something? The panel. Yeah. I think it's a panel. But yeah. Some pretty sweet abs. Cause them on in the bathroom. Steve? Steve Monaco? No, Steve Morocco. Yeah, Steve Morocco. Yeah, he's a cool man, guy, man. Yeah, he plays the, plays the drums. Pretty good. I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty good. Don't have fake abs, no. No fake abs. Yeah. Fish Out of Water. It's my favorite album. The only album I ever heard. It's my favorite. Yeah, go buy it now. Yeah, I remember when uh, Steve blew up. Yeah. Pretty crazy. In the alley. No dumpster. Not you, but. Dude's head landed on me. It's weird. It's so crazy. I'm trying to cry a little bit. Pop my shoes. That's just too. Yeah, Steve, man. He's a good guy, but. Go miss him. Free t shirt. Burnham lives on. Actually, no, I don't. I promise never to play again. He's got my free t shirts.